What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Nash here. Welcome back to the channel. And now you guys are probably wondering, wait a minute, it's only been been like a minute. Why are you making another video on a Monday? Well, we just got the fucking ban list. So, yeah, yeah, a Yu-Gi-Oh video and a WWE video all in one day. Hmm. Who knew? Anyway, yes, we got the ban list today. Um, I did a prediction video. I think it was like last week or so, last week or or something like that. Um. Final predictions, I think I'm going to say Dragoon to 1, which really wouldn't matter. Um, and then, as far as, as, then, as, as, far as like, cards that get banned, I, it, it's, it's hard to tell. But I'm on the ban list website right now, so no, no copyrights here. But I'm scrolling right now. Uh, so if, 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 if you guys know, if, if a card... If if it says forbidden, that means you can't use use the card. Limited means you, you can use one copy. Semi limited means you, you can use two. And then if it's if, if it says no longer on the list, you're free to use up to three if you wish. So I'm scrolling down the monsters. Um. Wow. Okay. What? Hold on. Is this? Did they release it? They must not have. Oh wait, 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 wait! It must be on, on the it, apparently, apparently, I think it's on the Euro website. Let's see. Is it? Hang on, guys. Something's off. Something is way, 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 way off. Here we are. This might work. This might be the one I'm looking for. Yeah, here we are. Here we are. This is this is the one. The the one I was looking for. Okay, so I'm scrolling down right now. I had to look look it up on the Euro website. Let's see. Nothing yet. Nothing so far. Zodiac Barrage. Okay, that's interesting. Zodiac Barrage is kind of an interesting card. So, if you guys don't know about Zodiac, Zodiac Barrage, I'm actually going to look it up on on Neuron right now. No copyrights here, of course. Um, but Zodiac Barrage is actually a continuous spell, and I believe this is to stop the Tri Brigade Zoo decks, if I remember correctly. Um, let's see. All right, let's see here. Zodiac Barrage. You can target one face of card. You control, destroy, and if you do spell summon a Zodiac monster from your deck, you can only use this effect once per turn. If this card is destroyed by a card effect and sent to the grave, you can target one Zodiac. Exceeds, you control, attach the card from, from your graveyard to that Exceeds monster as material. Okay, so basically it's, um, so it's a card that basically allows you to to target pretty much any card you have on the field, destroy it, and and just and just summon a Zodiac right off the bat, which was perfect. Which was perfect for the Tri Brigade decks because Tri Brigade actually utilized actually utilized the Zodiac decks like instantly. So yeah, wow, that's it. That that that's the only card that got banned. So let's take a look at oh. Eva also got eliminated. Also got limited. I got eliminated. Really? So let's take 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 a look at Eva. Uh, if this card is sent sent to the grave, you can match up to two other life fairies from your field and or graveyard at the same number of level two or lower life fairies from your from with, with different names from your deck to your hand. Except this card. Oh, so it was basically a double one for one. It it it, it was basically um, it it was basically a double one for one when when it's sent to the graveyard. Wow. That's that that's interesting. I'm why though. I don't remember the, the this card being used. Unless maybe lights weren't. No, no, no. Maybe um, maybe there was a Moki Moki deck that used this deck. I have no clue. That's interesting. 
Uh, prank kids, meow, meow, moo. Oh. <laughs> ah. Okay. All right, prank kids. Uh, is this the one? Yeah. Um, prank kids, meow, meow, moo. Uh, it requires a level four or one level low, one level four lower prank kids monster. Uh, you can only link link some in th this card once per turn. If a prank kids monster you control would attribute itself to activate its effect during your opponent's turn, you can manage the card you you control from. You control or from your graveyard instead. Oh, oh! Now I get it. Okay, so so it's basically to ensure that um, I get it now. So because that, so because that this card, so it's it, it, it's because of the fact that this card was 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 abusable to prevent you from banishing your mon your prank kids monsters. Okay, now I understand. That's interesting. Fire Formation Techie, that's an interesting one. I think it's for the... Tribegate Zoo? Hang on. I believe so, yeah. Yeah, I thought so. Yeah, basically it's for the... It, that, that, that was for the... Um, the... What you call it? The Tribergate Zoo decks. Okay, that 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 makes sense. That that makes sense. I kind of figured, I had a suspicion that that they would take out Tenki, that they would put Ten Tenki to one, because uh, there was a video from Crush Cards. Shout out, no copyrights, of course. Um, where I think Logan Logan had was playing Tri Tribergate Zoo, and she I, I think one of her, she her her and her man Brian do this thing called Let's Top Locals and. One, and she was playing Tribegate Zoo. She opened up with three Tenki. So this actually makes sense. That doesn't. That really doesn't surprise me. Uh, okay. So now. Okay. So that's it for the, for, for for the cards that are limited. Now for the cards that are semi limited. So I'm kind of curious about this because I know that last time the only card that got semi limited was Militia. So let's see. <coughs> what? What? Danger Nessie, Skull Corbett Joker, and a Mercy Teleport? No, 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 I, no, this, Konami, what are you doing? Nessie, I can, I can kind of understand. Skull Corbett Joker is whatever, because nobody, I, I don't think anybody uses that card anymore, but Teleport? What are you doing, Konami. This now means that any deck that and that means that now any psychic based decks will now be able to completely abuse this card to the point of no return. Wow, that's just stupid. Now for the cards that are no longer on the list, Double Iris Magician. Okay, this is weird. This is interesting. So Skullcrabat Joker. Let's see. All right, let's see. So, Performer Pal Skull Crabat Joker. Its pendulum, its pendulum effect says you cannot pen some pen. You cannot pen some in monsters except pendulum, except except Performer Pal, except per, except Performer Pal, Magician Pen, and Odd Eyes Monsters. This effect cannot be negated. All right, sounds that's pretty broke broken enough for me. Uh, when this card is normal summon, you can add a Performer Pal Monster, Magician Pendulum, or Odd Eyes Monster from your deck to your hand. Except this card. So yeah, ba basically it was just a rota. It was it, it was basically a rota for the deck. Now double iris magician. I'm kind of in interested about this one. Let's see, double, double iris magician. Uh, pendulum effect says once per turn you once per turn you can target a dark spellcaster in your grit in uh, uh, you control. Apply this effect to it, then destroy this card. Once apply, double any battle damage that that monster inflicts to your opponent this turn if it battles an opponent's monster. So basically, it was able to just deal deal basically double damage. Um, uh, 
And then it's Monster Effect says says this, this card is always treated as a Pendulum Dragon. Uh, if if, uh, if this card is destroyed by Battle of Card Effect, you can add a, pen, a Pendulum Graph card from your deck to your hand. So basically, it was in the form of like Rota, so so to speak. Okay, this is in. So I had a suspicion that they were not. I kind of figured that they weren't gonna. I know that that, that I said that I wanted Dragoon to one, but I knew that they were never. They were never gonna hit. Hit cards like cards like cards like Red Eyes Fusion or anything like that because Red because because truth be told if you because truth truth be told the only card in the in the Red Eyes Fusion lineup that definitely should have gotten hit was obviously was was obviously Verde Anaconda because with Verde An An Anaconda it's a polarization on, on its own because all you do. Is pay is pay two thousand. Let's see. Let's see. So Verde and the Conda, I'll read off Verde's effect. You can target one face of monster on the field. It becomes dark until the end of the turn. You can pay 2,000 life points and send a fusion or polymerization normal or quick spell from your, deck, from your deck to the grave. This effect becomes that spell's effect when that card is activated. Also, you cannot spell summon monsters for, for the rest of the turn. You can only use each effect once per turn. It's basically polymerization. It's, it's its own polymerization. This card ensures that your fusion plays can, act, can go through if you have the right cards. This card basically helps... People summon Red Eyes Dark Dragoon, and I know this because I, I actually run it in a few decks. But truth be told, but truth be told, if Red Eyes Fusion were to get banned, let's say let's say it did, you can use Waking the Dragon to summon it. Simple. You can use Waking Waking the Dragon to summon it, but. Honestly, this is kind of an interesting uh, ban list. Um, Zudia Barrage, I'm not surprised about. Obviously, because of the because of the uh, Tribe Against Zoo decks, Eva's kind of an in interesting one. I believe there was a fairy. I, I I think I think there was a fairy deck from the last YCS um, from from the last Remote Dual y YCS that ran. Eva, so maybe that might have been might might have been the case. Prank hands, uh, prank hands, meow meow moo. I'm not surprised about um, this card. Really, it it really does doesn't surprise me that this card got 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 limited to one. Tanky, I'm I'm not surprised. Again, the again the zoo the tribal gate zoo decks. Um, Nessie is kind of uh, kind of whatever. Uh, Skull Crabat Joker is like. Okay, it's not like it's not like really good as far as like today's meta goes, but I wouldn't be be, be surprised if if uh, Triff Gaming actually were to make this deck make this card relevant. Um, a Mercy Teleport. I don't know what the hell Konami Konami. I don't know what the fuck you guys were thinking, but yeah, it is it, it, it is what it is. And then double Irish magician again, just be just being able to just deal double damage to your opponent. So yeah, it's pretty decent, but yeah, that's the ban list. I don't know what to say. I'm kind of su I'm slightly surprised about about uh, the cards that I got semi limited and the card that was taken off the list. Um, so I think the only decks that got hit were obviously the Tribagate Zoo, um, I don't know what, what deck ran Eva, if you guys know, comment below, because I have no idea, um, uh, Prank Kids, Prank Kids took, took a slight hit, even though there are ways you can still abuse the living hell out of Prank Kids, Meow Meow Moo, um, you know, and then of course... The cards, and of course, the decks are they're going to become meta again. Obviously, our decks that can that will be able to to abuse Nessie, uh, be able to abuse a Mercy Teleport, be able to, 
And then, and, and then of course, the Pendulum Magician decks, obviously, double, with, double, with double Iris to three, and Skullcrack Joker to two. There's no doubt that that Pens, Triff Gaming might be right. It might be best deck. Who knows? But that's going to do it for, for this video. Um, again, I can't say that I'm surprised. Uh, I had a suspicion that they were not going to ban... You know Verde, you know Verde and and you know Verde Anaconda or whatever. So, um, it is it it is what it is. Maybe in the next ban list we might see Rarest Fusion get get eliminated. May or maybe we might see Verde Anaconda get banned. We might see Mystic Mind get banned finally because I know that people want Mystic Mind banned. Um, it's hard to say. It's hard to say, but um, only only time will tell. Only time will tell. The next ban list I believe we're getting will be. January 17th, so, so, yeah, I'm kind of curious, January 17th of next year, wow, 2022, who knew, who knew that we, that we were getting close to 2022, but guys, that's, that, that will do it for this video, hopefully you guys enjoyed, if you did, make sure you guys smash that thumbs up button, let me know in the comments below your, your thoughts on, on the ban list, and if you guys are new, new to the channel, and you guys want to see more ban list, ban list reveals in the foreseeable future, Make sure you make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you guys don't miss out on any new content that comes your way. And be sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram. All the links will be down in the description below. And if you guys have fan mail that you want to send me and want me to open up on the channel, my address will also be in the description as well. And on that, this is your boy Nash, signing out.